Hello there, it's Terry from Terry B Fancy Crafts and I'm live today because I've got some new um, dies, Sweet Dixie dies. my mind had just gone then. I've done this video um, twice now, the first time um, it was blurry so I had to delete it so I'm going to try it again because I think that might have had something to do with the um, in fact, I was on a webcam instead of uh, the laptop, so I'm on the laptop now. Anyway, let's go for it. I've got some backing stocks first, um, Christmas ones. Right. The first one is um, the stockings that actually um, did sell out. Um, they sold out really fast, actually, um, and I can see why, because um they'd be um great on all types of cards you can make um little mini bunting um you can cut them into separate parts and if you've got the um presents the santa sleigh um there's lots you can put in there so they're back in stock as i say they went um, they went actually quicker than I was expecting them to go. They were there one minute, I looked around and they were gone. Um, these are not so much back in stock as a top up because um, they sell very well. I think I just cut one out by here. Unorganized. Well, it's got a tag stuck to it at the moment. Ignore the tag, it's not supposed to be on there. There we go, and that's how they come out there. Quite um, they're a sizable die, as those who've seen them before know. Um, so, yeah, that's the Merry Christmas dies. The stockings are £5.50. Um, as usual, they're Sweet Dixie, excellent value, and excellent quality. Um, so um, these are actually five ninety nine, which is great because um, very very quick way of making a card. Um, it just needs that as a focal point, and I think you've seen cards that I've made before. Okay, so back in stocks. This um, this is eight ninety nine, and it's um, the Holly Border. I don't know if you can see. I'm trying out different lights, and I think the one over here is interfering. You can see that, but there are some um, photographs uh, around that um, have these in. I'll, I'll try and um, point them out on the on my page, um, and if they're not there, I'll try and um, put some up for you. <laughs> Hi Fiona, yeah, I sorted it because what had happened was it was. Um, the camcorder, I was going through the camcorder and instead of the laptop and the laptop is much better. But I can't do things um, looking down, I, I'm not able to sort of do a demo, so I'm going to have to upload them. No big deal, but at least I know what works and what don't. So, we're doing all my nice, lovely new dies. So, this is the big stocking and I'm not doing well with the lighting. I don't know if I turn that one off and then I go dark. Mm. Can you see them better, do you think? Uh, no, I think that. So there's the dies themselves. As you can see, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven dies, and that's £7.50. Now, um that is pretty fantastic for um the cost of dies um especially with the value and as i say another lot back in stock um because everybody likes them and another one that i get in stock i don't know i should buy about um 200 of them i think <laughs> they go every time every every time and i can never get this to go there we are look these are eight ninety nine, um, two sizable dies, and you can actually um, cut all these out and make 
um, a village with sort of back them up behind. Here, Paula. Okay. Right, more back in stocks. These are not Christmas, they're the, just the basics. Um, they're excellent dies and um, they're 10.99 they're fair size um again just something like that on the card um with some toppers on it's even a happy birthday just hoping you can see these right here yeah. and then we've got the um round ones Similar, similar pattern. No, it's not. It's, there they are. I'm a bit rusty with uh, doing these videos. And there's those dice. Uh, I've been all excited here today with these guys. They came yesterday and I couldn't um, wait to get them out. Right, now some Halloween. Can't see it like that. This one's £6.50. And then you've got in there, you've got Boo, you've got um, a ghost. I do think it's going to be better with this. Here are. You've got the ghost and you've got the churchyard. Okay. Oh. Yep. More Halloween. I think this is the last one of these. There's the spiders. Two sizable spiders. You've also got... Um, the spider's webs, I'm just wrong way around. Two sizable spider's webs and one large spider and one tiny one. Then, where do I go next? Okay. I thought I had these in order. Bear with me, bear with me. Right, now into babies. Rocking horse. Believe it or not, this is the last one. All sold out. Um, and that's before I got them on the website. People heard that these were coming and they've sold out. So that one is five pounds. So if you want it, I'm going to a show Saturday, so you'll have to get in quick. Right, these um, were dies. That was actually, yeah, I said five pounds, didn't I? In case I didn't, it's five pounds. Um, these are actually word dies. And as you can see, you've got Bundle of Joy. Um, by here it says it's a and then you've got girl and boy and you've got um precious little one um and there's the size of them oh you've also got an exclamation mark there they're five pounds so they're they're very very useful i would say and um, this one is so sweet it's four pound fifty and it's the um baby group and that's a tidy little size as well with a little teddy bear there oh i didn't i didn't do them very well i'm sorry then we're back to halloween we've got a pumpkin and a bat as you can see four pound fifty for a pumpkin and a bat now these are so cute i've got a card up with um the giraffe and i think i've either put the elephant up or it's coming next but they both come in the actual same um packet and they're five pound for the two the little giraffe and the elephant they are very very cute more babies I've, there's loads and loads of stuff in there for six pound fifty one two three four five six seven eight dies if i count the feet as one yeah the feet are one okay so you've got um the baby written on blocks you've got a bottle um a rattle the feet a pin a dummy abc blocks and a bow as i say six pound fifty excellent value then we're into the world of fantasy. So first of all, we've got a dream catcher. Um, it's the dream catcher. The word is dream. And you've got um, two extra feathers there as well. 
that's five pound fifty. Be great for um, teenager cards, um, boys and girls alike. I would say. But no, it's not fantasy. It's a fantasy castle. Um, it's smaller than the one I've had before, but it's only four pound fifty, and it is quite a good size. Okay, nice to you. Nice to nice to see you, Paula. Thanks for thanks for joining. You can always pick it up later, mind. <laughs> oh, you've got a slave driver as a boss, haven't you? See you later. Right. Now we've got Pegasus. And that's... Oh, my mind keeps wandering today. It's 5 99 and a lovely size and, and a lovely die as well. Right up my street. This to go with the dream catcher guy. Bring the dream catcher back if I can. Yep. When dream catcher die, you then got um some feathers on their own with the I'm gonna guess now what this is top of a like a thing that hangs you hang the fed, feathers on yeah it's lovely isn't it Lucy I like that Pegasus as well in fact I like quite a lot of them and if they don't um if I bring any back on after the show I might treat myself I don't know so there's the feathers and that was the dreams. Now, the next one is unusual. It's a wolf. The, Pegasus, uh, the feathers was five pounds. That's a wolf. Very interesting because you've got all the um, fur there. And if you, if you cut this out in two different colours, you can fill in the nose and eyes. Um, with the other colour. It's called um, paper piercing, I think. Um, a lot of people use that method anyway, but it's particularly good with the wolf. Then we have everyone's favourite, a unicorn. It's just the unicorn's head. Again, you can do the paper piercing. The wolf was £5. This one, too, is a £5. Look at that. So much detail on there, and they do. If you haven't had Sweet Dixie before, they actually um, do sort of fall out, right? Of the dies, I mean, they don't sort of fall out of the sky or anything. I'm having a nutty, um, nutty half hour today. Sorry, I was I was more serious yesterday when it all went wrong. Right, calm down. Right, dragons, another favourite. Um, these are smaller. There was there was a a, a bigger um, die. They had like a circle around it. The, I think the dragon's probably the same size, but without the sort of circle. And this one sat in a different position or stood in a different position. These are five pound as well which is excellent value um, and they're a nice size and the cutest little dragon you ever did see some of you will have seen that i put a photograph up of um, one of the cards that sue dix the designer of these um made and <laughs> look at that with the eggs now this actually could be used for easter as well as um as well as every day and um, you can put a little chick in those two eggs which come um, separate I mean in halves um, you could also put them together of course and make an Easter egg from them or just have the little dragon popping out of this shell I love them it's done. now these last two are my favorite favorite favorites favorite favorite this is a moon fairy look at that 
The dragon, oh, that dragon is only £4.50. Wow. Wow. This one is so gorgeous, this moon fairy. I could take it off the moon, actually. Yeah, you could. You can just see, sort of cut into um, the wings there, there ahead. Yeah. So you could separate that from the moon. Isn't she gorgeous? Absolutely fabulous. Six pound, this one. That's all, just six pound. By the way, these are all up on the website now. They're in the new arrival section as well as the Sweet Dixie um, category as well. Um, I'll put a list, I'll put um, a link up to those two categories after on this um, thread. And last, by no means least, I think this is my favourite, favourite, favourite. It's £8. Look at that. The little mushroom house, well, the little mushroom house is a big mushroom house with flowers, a butterfly, and a dragonfly. Now, you see the flowers, they um, will pop out separate, but they're one die, as you can see down here. There's the flowers, there's the butterfly, and there's the dragonfly. But look at that mushroom house. I think. Possibly, possible that the door might open, it might not. I don't know. Isn't that brilliant? And this, believe it or not, is only £8. Can't go wrong, can you? Right, that's it for today. Other than, um, most of you may have seen that I put this up in, um, I think it's in... The Facebook page plus the Terry's Creating Corner. Um, it's done using um, a print from one of the Magic Graphics CDs, Your Words or Mine, and it says, it says Time for Wine. It's been printed onto tissue paper and then I've actually put it onto a canvas that was um, distressed with distress ink and then distressing through a um, stencil. Now that video will be up um, by the end of next week. Um, it's all in the process. Um, I just need to tweak it a bit and um, yeah, it will definitely be up by the end of the week. Um, so it will show you, as I say, how to print on paper, um, print on tissue paper, um, making a carrier sheet and how I distressed it with and what I used to put the distress ink on. So that's it from me today. Um, I don't think I've got anything else to tell you. If you want to subscribe to my newsletter, please do. Um, there's a subscription at the top of the Facebook page. There's a subscription on my web website, which is www.fantasycrafts.co.uk. Um, if you're watching this on YouTube, please give me a subscribe um, because I'm beginning to put up some tutorials now and tips on there. So if you want to keep up to date, um, please do so. Um, those that have joined me and are watching, thank you ever so much. Um, and I'll see you again. Perhaps I won't leave it too long next time. Bye. Still here. Bye.